Hey guys, I'm back with another episode of Wanna Trade Wednesday. This is part two of episode two. I'm sorry guys, my I tried to re record this. This is my third Wanna Trade out of the batch. Like the third of the second row. And it kept connection interrupting so my my iPad would keep um turning off. So I'm sorry but I Here's the Pokemon I got. I got a Japanese level 3 uh, Fletchling, a Gibbled, which is Jolly, so that's going to be helpful whenever it evolves into Garchomp. Ponyard, Jolly, and it's got Stealth Rock, so ooh, that's a good enough. That's another good one. These are both pretty good Pokemon. So at the end of this episode, I'm going to show the best Pokemon I got, in my opinion. Also, I think after this trade is the big three, the level 14 and the two level 28s. Um, Alice from Idaho. Sorry about the moving, I'm not in my normal recording spot. It is like nine. It's it's nine fourteen right now, and we got another Fletchling. See, Wonder Trading, I think, in my opinion, is so broken. Cause all you get is crap. Like you trade away, um, maybe a shiny, and you'll probably get a freaking Magic card. I think they should make tiers, like what you're, like maybe a very bad tier, a good tier, and then a very good tier. The very good tiers being legendaries and shinies, and the very bad tiers being fletchlings. And you can only trade away the the other ones in that exact tier. So you can only trade Pokemon in that tier. So we have our level 14, serious own tempo, Smeargle, caught in a Ultra Ball. See what we get. Sorry about that. And we got a Burmy. I think is what it's called. Yep, Bernie. One second. Uh, sorry, I had to move a little bit. Okay. Now with the two level 28. So, here we go. Impish, level 28, male, own tempo, smear gold. The male and the female were I used to breed them because I'm not sure, but I'm not in pot. It didn't allow me to um, breed with Ditto. Not entirely sure why, but it didn't let me. Sorry about the moving camera. iPad, I meant, not camera. Don't have my camera charged yet. This is Need Shiny. She's Jessie from Washington. Okay, let's see if I can get a good angle. We got a Froakie. It'd be totally cool if I got a Shiny Froakie from Wonder Trading. Or just a Shiny Froakie in general. We'll have to see what um, nature this is. If it's protein, then this is the best one I'm going to probably get. Well, one of the best. Okay, so let's go with another. Okay, let's see. It's protein, modest, and it looks like it's four IVs. Not entirely sure, but that is my best pool, I think. I've got myself another battle Pokemon. Here's the female Rash own tempo, level 28 Smeargle.
Who are we going to get today? Star Skitty. Good God. Dang it. Not dang it. It's the other word. Nappy. I'm not sure where she's from because I didn't get done with her thing. But her name is Star Skitty. And I got a... What's it called again? I think it's like a... It's a Gumi, okay. I was about to say Sabu. Okay, I'll take good care of it. Okay, well, it looks like that was the last wonder trade, so... I'm gonna go inside of my box. Okay, here's all of the Pokemon I got that I think. I got this Adamant Level 1 um, Moxie Female Heracross. Wait. Well, here's just all the pulls in general. And then I'll say which one is the best. So we have... It's got egg moves. We got Tyrant with no egg moves. And it's a, it looks like, I'm not even sure, but it's a, what ability? Rash ability. Let's see if I can do it this way. Wait, and we got a Zigzagoon. No egg moves if it's even hatched, which it probably isn't. So again, we got this, mm, wait, we got this Timber, egg moves. And it is Japanese. It's got guts ability and it's hasty. But yeah, this is good as naughty ability. Okay, this Pampor is hardy ability. No egg moves. And it wasn't even hatched. We got this Ralt. No egg moves. And it is bold. And it is Spilly's Trace. We got another Rolts. This one's a Japanese Rolts. And it's a modest ability. So we got this Japanese Fletchling. Quiet Nature. No. Well, it's not even hat. Okay, we got this Gibble, which I'm actually pretty happy about because of its jolly nature. So up next we have Paul Neard, which is another good pair, which is another good Paul Jolly. It's pretty good, and it's got Psycho Cut Berserk, Sucker Punch, and Stealth Rock. Stealth Rock is one of my favorites because of I got that's what I got. Got a Fletchling level five. This one is a Dark Isle route, and we got this Burmy. It's a Gentle Nature, and there's the stats, and it's got Protect. We got this Froakie, which is another very good pull. It's got Pound and Growl. Mm, no egg moves. Wait, crap. Um, it's Modest Nature. It, it, its ability is it gets hatched. And its ability is Protein. So that was very thankful. I got a Gumi. So it's got a tack, Tackle and Bubble. It's dragon type and it's got a quiet nature and it's a hatched. And that was the last of the Pokemon. So if you guys enjoyed this video, please rate, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. Sorry for the long video and bye.